massage it into your hair from the roots to the ends and then you comb it through that's it the tangle in How are you? How are you doing today? This is Jumi and I wanted to make a video of uh, me using cocoa shea butter. I hope you can see it. Yep. That, that. Let me show you how I'm going to be using this to detangle my hair. So sometimes I use um, I use conditioner to detangle my hair and some other times I use the um, whipped mango or the whipped cocoa shea to detangle my hair. So today I am using the whipped cocoa shea to detangle my hair and I just wanted to let you know like it can be used for different purposes. Sometimes I use it as a living conditioner as well or I use it to twist out my hair. It really depends on my mood and you know how I'm feeling. So I don't know what you currently use to detangle your hair but I um, sometimes use a conditioner to detangle my hair or um, sometimes I use I'm going to take this one from the back sometimes I use um, sometimes I use um, con conditioner to detangle my hair or I use the Glam Naturally Coco Mango Shade so my hair is dry but not too dry because I actually always keep my hair moisturized and then just spray a little bit of water so I'm only going to do this section for now because I don't want to make the video too long so only this section, it's nice and wet, and then all you need is a little bit. So it melts very quickly, see, the butter is quite thick because you have to remember it is organic. So I finger detangle first, right my ash. So finger to tangle, gently and gently and I just wanted to show you after you apply your cocoa shea butter or your mango shea what it should look like. So it automatically and right away makes my hair feel a lot softer. I have very kinky hair. My hair is actually not that soft but because of all of the TLCs and amazing products that I put in it. It makes it feel soft. You see how easy it is for me to get through every strand of my hair by um, using the cocoa and mango shea butter just to detangle. You can use either or. I like the cocoa shea because number one, you have to remember when you're using it as a detangler, you're washing it off. The cocoa shea butter is cheaper. The mango shea is more expensive. So I use the mango shea to sit in my moisture to, to actually moisturize my hair because that stays longer. And I use the cocoa shea butter to um to the tango and I wanted to show you the consistency of my hair. You see how soft it makes it feel? So this part is done. This part is detangled. I'm just gonna put it in a two strand twist. I'm getting it ready to wash my hair. You know wash day is awesome right for us. And you see how healthy I just trimmed my hand trimmed my hands so it's always good to trim your hands as well and how do you know that your hair your hands are trimmed and not ready to be trained. If you can twist it and the hands of it are not just had it up together, that's how you know <laughs> it is twisted. It's um your um washing your hair or the tango in your hair. It's very important for you to be patient with it, remember? You cannot rush this process. You have to be very patient and take your time because you don't want your hair to cause more breakage or you don't want your hair to break more. So that part is done. I'm going to take the hands right here. And do that next. And you see how healthy my hair is looking? I do a lot of TLC to my hair. And the hair I'm braided on is my friend. I use both. Daily. Alright, so like I said, my hair is not super dry because I um I do you know, I don't leave my hair dry because I don't want my hair to break. Again, just a t your cocoa shea or your mango shea, a tiny bit. See how much I have in my hand. It's a very thick butter, so you don't need, actually I have to reduce it. You don't need that much because of its thickness. And then you just apply from your 
from the ends to from the roots to the ends. Okay. And this is me detangling my hair. You see that? It actually, it, this is this detangling process is so easy for me, and that's because my hair is already moisturized before I actually started doing this. And um, I keep it moisturized. I use the mango and cocoa shit. It actually helps. I don't know if you can see your curls get activated as well. But that part is the tangled. That was easy, right? You see what I mean? So, and it's healthy. Water is added. So you see, the water. And then I'm gonna apply. You just need a tiny bit of it. And then you massage it into your hair from the roots to the ends. And then you comb it through. That's it. The tangling is not that bad if you're using if you're doing it the right way and you're using the right product. So if you don't have the cocoa shea butter. I actually recommend that for detangling or as a leave-in. You can also use it as a leave-in as well, leave-in conditioner. Um, see, you see my hair? See? You see how moisturized this feel? And then you put it in a two-strand twist. Easy, super duper easy. My hair is soft and moisturized. See that? This is 4C hair, guys. But can you believe that? That's 4C hair because it is super super moisturized. I feel like I needed to do this video because I always say you can use the cocoa shares of the tangler, but I'm not sure if a lot of my customers actually know this or use it as that. So, okay. So. The front is done. Do you see how healthy my hair looks? Healthy, my scalp. I haven't even, because I use the braid oil daily as well, and I haven't even washed my hair in three weeks, but you can see how clean my scalp looks because the braid oil helps you maintain a healthier scalp. Yeah. A picture of what it looks like after. But see my hair? This is one year after big chopping, and just doing the right things is keeping my hair healthy and longer and healthy. So that's how I detangle my hair and that's how I'm going to be washing that section. Literally going to be washing it that way. I'm not taking out the twist. I will wash it in the twist. Because when you do that, it helps, it helps keeps it moisturized better. So I'm not trying to wash my hair. I just want to wash my scalp because my hair is not that dirty. So I'm going to be targeting my scalp and then using the rest of the ladder to wash my, my, um, my twist that I'm about to put my hair. So I hope that helps. Like I said. All I've used in this video is the Glam Naturally Oil Coco Shea Butter to detangle my natural 4C hair. So if you're going to try this, let me know. I would like to see your results. You know, if you already have this product, I would like to see your results just detangling using the Glam Naturally Oil um, Coco Shea. Thank you for watching. I hope this video helps you better. I'm also going to be doing um, a twist out with the mango shea butter because there's someone requested that on Instagram. So I am listening. I'm going to be working on that. Thank you. Or maybe sometime. The next video. I promise. But thank you so much for your purchase. Thank you for using Glam Naturally Oil. And oh, don't forget to use, you see how clear my skin looks? The facial serum. I use this morning and night as well. And I don't normally use, I don't do lots of filters in my, I don't actually do filters. Um, I don't like to put makeup on when I'm doing my um, videos because I want you to see how clear my skin looks just using the products that I promote and use on myself. So yeah. Happy Bye.